Good morning, everyone. Uh, this is Isaac from Cambridge Foods by Isaac. Uh, as you can see, I just woke up. Hair's a little uh, bed heady. But I wanted to share with you uh, an alternative to using our shakes um, for a meal. We have here what's called Cambridge Super Oats. Uh, it goes along with the same uh, program of the Food for Life. Um, so you can have this, shakes. There's also um, soups that are available. Uh, but this is great for breakfast when you want something hearty. It's uh, oatmeal, and a lot of people love oatmeal. So I just wanted to show you how simple it is to do. So I'll give you a close-up of the product here, Cambridge Super Oats. And what you do is you just put two scoops. Get my scooper here. Two level scoops. You want to get as level as you can. You see here, that's the size of the scoops. So you want to put two scoops. There's one. And it's like I got a little over there. And there's two. And you just want to add this to about eight ounces or so of hot water. And what I do, because I happen to have a Keurig uh, coffee maker, is I just put water in that so I've got my hot water right here ready to go and I noticed that when I mixed it once before I've done this a couple of times wanted to make sure I got it right for the video and I noticed that if I just add the water in gradually I may not even need all of this water because some people like a thicker oatmeal some people like a soupy oatmeal I like mine a little more on the thick side so I'm just gonna mix this together and uh, You'll see how quickly this comes together. I'll get a nice close-up of this so you can see how it turns out. So just bear with me for a minute while I do some stirring. You want to make sure you get it well blended. A lot of our Cambridge products recommend that you put things in a blender uh, to help speed this process along. Now, I don't have a blender that can handle hot liquids. Um, I use one of those Ninja Kitchen uh, blenders, which also works like a food processor. And that works well, but you can't use hot liquids. So instead of mixing this with cold water and then like microwaving it, I figured it's just easy enough to stir it right in my bowl with uh, the hot water from my coffee maker. So. This is kind of the consistency that I like. Let's see if I can tilt that without spilling on my laptop here. <laughs> so the one thing about this product, it's a great base, but you need to add stuff to make it more palatable for you. So like this doesn't have any sweetness to it. So what I found is a great alternative to that. You can try adding, you know, honey, cinnamon, etc. I tried that. I tried agave nectar. You had to add too much for it to really work. But what I found, I bought here some blueberry preserves, the uh, Planner All Fruit, which is fruitened by natural, uh, fruit and sweetened by natural fruit juice, and uh, it's only 35 calories for a tablespoon. And you know, in the Cambridge program, uh, we do count our calories to make sure that we have within reason for our caloric intake of the day. So what I do, oops, and since I'm pretty much only using this with my oatmeal, I'm just going to take this spoon and just dig right in. So I find if you add maybe two to this and give it a good stir, of course it's going to start turning bluish purple. And uh, But it adds just the right amount of sweetness without going crazy with calories. And of course, you know, our tastes are all different. You might want to add less fruit. You might want to add more. Just be mindful of the calories. So uh, one tablespoon, just, you know, is three teaspoons. Uh, sometimes we forget those measurements, those conversions. But here it is again. I'm going to tilt so you can see. So it's got the blueberry mixed in there. And that's pretty much it. We have a good meal here ready to go. So with that, I want to say thank you for watching and uh, stay tuned. I'm going to be uh, showcasing many more of our Cambridge products for you. And I like to demo them myself to show you that I'm not just selling, but I'm also a user. And uh, so far, I've lost about 20 pounds. So things are going well, and I, 
I wish you success.